Hey guys, I'm just going to be Matthew and today I'll be dealing with the fourth experiment of the case tool slab and that's collaboration diagram. So first of all, let's understand what is the collaboration diagram. Here you can see it talks about UML interaction diagram and there are two types of interaction diagram. So the first one is collaboration diagram uh, and the next one is sequence diagram. Sequence diagram already we have seen in the last uh, video and there's some redundancy between collaboration and sequence diagram they differently show how elements interact over time then collaboration diagram shows relationship between objects so first of all let me tell you a shortcut trick so this is how we made a sequence diagram in the previous experiment and just go to model and click on this convert diagram and if you do convert sequence to collaboration you will get this diagram so this is how a collaboration diagram looks like so uh, it automatically creates from just we need to uh, go to model and then convert sequence to collaboration diagram so here we can see first of all uh, um, it's requesting authentication the admin request authentication and then student is giving a login request to the authentication and then student and the next step is requesting for a course from the course selection after that uh, the when it reaches the course selection it checks for the availability whether that course is available or not and even the faculty can give a login request after that if the course is available the admin sends back uh, to the course selection block that the course is available so once the course is available the student selects it and then the course is allotted and that's shown in the result window and if the course is not available it goes through a self loop and uh, once the course is allotted uh, the payment is done the payment request is being sent to the student and once the payment is accepted the course is registered successfully so that is how a collaboration diagram works and it's really easy and as i told you just use the shortcut make the sequence diagram and then convert it to collaboration diagram once you convert it may be little like um, a web like structure it is very difficult to uh, arrange it but when you arrange it it will be like this so thank you for watching my video please do like share and subscribe thank you